Busy weekend for Mark Shine. Two games in Defiance yep. tonight. Two wins for Defiance. The boys and girls both victorious. A good girls game in particular. Both of the games were really good, Andy. And I, when you look at the, the boys game that took place tonight, there was one senior on the floor. Wow, really? And that was at, uh, from Defiance. A lot of young players. Defiance's top three scorers tonight were sophomores. They ended up winning the basketball game. A very competitive and good basketball game. In the girls game, it was a really good basketball game. The problem from Kenton was they couldn't make free throws. Oh, wow. They were one for 11 at one point. Ended up being a close game all the way. They just couldn't quite pull it out. But two good basketball teams that are both chasing Ottawa and Wapak in the, in the latest basketball. Tell us about the arena. What was oh, it like? It's absolutely wonderful. If you have a chance to go up and see, you just go see a game there. We had a chance to interview the superintendent Struble at halftime. That's going to be on in market market a little bit later on yeah. next week. But he just talked about how the they community came together to support the facility. It's a beautiful place. It seats about 2,500 people. Wow. They used to seat 1,900 in their old facility. It's chair back seats. It's got the cr crazies in the corner, oh, good. too. They, got they kept spot. those in there. Yeah. But what they did was they went to, obviously, the school situation. We talked basketball. But they went to a lot of different gyms. What do we like about your gym? Okay. And they tried to incorporate it into this one for the old people. Me being one, uh, the <laughs> superintendent Struble liked St. John's Arena that had the corner yes. scoreboards, and so they put those in. Oh, really? It's it's a really unique facility. It's a great place. They got a super video board in one ender. Uh, one end. They've done a great job of defiance. Congratulations, folks. You can catch it on WSN right now. The boys' game airing. Finally, tomorrow, a little reunion. Yeah. Mike Shep's back well, in town. Mark Miller got an idea, and we said, why don't we contact Mike Shep? You know, Mike did so many games here for so long, and many of those were Mansfield Senior and Lima Senior games. So he contacted Mike. Said, hey. How would you like to do a game with us? He's going to call it. Mark and I are going to do fill in with the color and the stats alongside of him. But that's tomorrow night. We're looking forward to that. 10 o'clock, TV 44. And, of course, close to look every Tuesday and on our WSN Sports YouTube channel. Girls basketball.